Hi everyone, it's me, Skipster for Life again, and I am back with a new game. I've played it once before, but it's been years, and it's such an amazing game. So, it's called East Shade. Um, if you haven't heard of it, well, you're just, you're gonna love it. Um, and if you have heard of it, well, lucky for you, I'm a completionist, so I probably will do every single maybe not every single achievement but every single um quest for sure so yeah without further ado let's hop right into it i can't wait for you guys to see what this game's all about oh what's my name i'll just do that here we go And we're starting. Oh, we're on a boat. I might have to turn my sensitivity down a little. I'm turning really fast. Oh, there's people. Fun. Oh, look at the lighting. It's gorgeous. Hello. Hello, monkey man. There we go. Forgive an old woman, but I forgot your name. What was it again? Skipster. Would you mind getting my book from the sleeping quarters? It would spare my bones the trip. It's called Great Voyages. Of course. I would love to grab your book for you. And it's right there. That was easy. And thank you very much. There we go. I've read this old book many times. Seems I find something new each read. And no matter how many times I've read it, it never fails to get me excited for adventure. Are you the adventuring type? Oh yes. Ah, after my own heart. I've had a lifetime of it, believe it or not. If you're sticking around in East Shade, maybe I'll tell you all about it sometime. Ooh, I'd love some. Captain Elona told me we'll be landing in Lindo shortly. I think we're all antsy to arrive. Just learned about a new topic. You can now inquire about this topic using the pick topic option when it's presented. Not everyone has something to say about every topic. Let's try and talk to someone else. Nope. Oh, here we go. I've never been to East Shed. I've heard wonderful things about it. Did you know that the people there used to cover their mouths with garments? I've heard that since gone mm. out of style. Quite a strange fashion fad, if you ask me. As Sounds like East us Shed in 2020. Ship, <laughs> I will love it. Topic. Oh, Lindo. It's quaint little seaside town we'll be landing in. It's one of the many gems of the country, I hear. Great. <sighs> Almost there. Oh. That doesn't sound good. Oh, that did not sound good. Mm-hmm. You can say that again. Oh! Whoa. <laughs> um, can any of you uh, breathe underwater by any chance? Can we... You know, open the door or something? Oh, okay. Well, that was a quick game. Bye! <laughs> Did I ever tell you about the trip your father and I took to East Shade? Tell me again. Of all the trips we took, that one was my favorite. You know, if you're ever looking for painting inspiration. I know, Mom. Tell me you'll visit one day. Promise you'll go. I promise. To think of you exploring Eastshade. It makes me so happy. I know you'll find inspiration there. What an adventure you'll have. Listen, there are some places you absolutely mustn't miss. Be sure to paint the giant tree. 
Ah, uh, I remember it like it was yesterday. How will I know which tree? <laughs> you won't miss it. Trust me. And the Tiffmore Bluffs. Ah, the lovely sky country. I can picture you there now, an easel set, and you making a beautiful painting. Those open skies and endless seas would move any artist. Okay, I will. And the city! There's a magnificent building in the center. From the very top floor, you can see the whole town and more. You won't be able to resist taking out your brushes. Ah, soon. You'll be there soon. You should get some rest, Mom. <gasps> Mother's last wishes. Oh, I forgot about that. <gasps> East Shade, here it goes! It's already stunning, and I just spun in. <laughs> I was about to just walk in the fire. Do you remember what happened? I was traveling on a ship. It collided with the reef. I'm glad the memory's intact. You washed up on this beach just a short while after the ship sank. One doesn't last long in water this cold. Did everyone else make it? From what I've heard, you were the only passenger misplaced during the wreck. The others are safe in town. Oh, good. East Where are we? Of course. Specifically, my home. I usually don't take visitors, but in this case, I can hardly blame you for floating in unannounced. Hmm. <laughs> Did any of my possessions float in? Only your easel. Don't forget to take it when you leave. Even the frigid tide couldn't bring you to part from it. It must mean a great deal to you. I won't forget. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let me know yourself. It's just up the path. Thank you for helping me. On your way. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You oh, on your okay. Way. I wasn't sure if there was more dialogue, because there was the thing above his head. Can I steal any of his stuff? Oh, it's so pretty. Look at all the water reflections. Oh, there's my easel. I was about to talk to him again? To share news no, okay, it is the same your... thing. <laughs> Oops. Okay, I am going to turn the music down real quick. It's <clears throat> very loud. Apply. Resume. Here, let's save it. Sweet. <gasps> Look how pretty. Oh, stunning. Oh my gosh. I can't get over this. <laughs> oh man, it's so pretty. Man, I were I wish I were here in real life. It's just so gorge. Oh, I can grab these. Sweet. Because I will need those at some point. Okay. Looks like we're in the town. <gasps> Lindo! Oh, look how pretty. <gasps> Did I just level up? Twice? Three times? Oh, inspiration, right. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you need inspiration in order to make paintings. And paintings you need for, like, quests and such. Oh, here's oh, a dear lady. You. You're on the ship. What happened to you? I washed up in a beach cave. Oh, thank goodness. We thought you were lost. Oh, what a horrible experience. I'm so glad to see you're safe. What brought you to Eastshade, anyway? My mother loved it here. Very adventurous of you. I came to visit my family. You look like you could use a nice cup of tea. This flavor is a bit strong for some people, but the effects can be lifted with a sip of water from your water skin. 
Thank you. Our captain is in a terrible state. I suppose that's to be expected. Mm, she won't even leave the dock. Perhaps it would console her to know that we all survived. You should speak with her. Where are you staying? My family lives here in Lindo, so I'll be staying with them. If you find that night is coming and you're in need of a place to stay, you should check the inn. You'll be comfortable there. It gets awesome. cold around here at night. You shouldn't be out without a proper coat. Big topic. Ooh, Lindo. After that wreck, I may just settle down here for a while. Mm -hmm. Are you wondering about anything else? Uh, nope. Take care. Awesome. Okay, let's check out this building here. <gasps> That's so pretty! Oh, look at that view! You can see the whole town! Don't mind me, I'm just gonna... Oh, I can't. Dang it. Yeah. Okay. It's not like Skyrim where you can just parkour over anything. <laughs> awesome. Oh, is that? I'm a bird! Oh. Of course you are. Aren't I good at flying? Oh, you certainly are. Thanks! My dad says that I can do anything as long as I put my mind to it! That's great. Keep doing it, kid. Just don't... Sh don't jump off any buildings. Ooh, who's in here? Uh-oh. Nika? Is that you? No. You must be one of the tourists. Terrible about the sinking and all that. Glad you're okay. Yada, yada, etc. Uh, but will you go get Nika, the innkeeper? I need help. Why is there a jug on your head? <laughs> it's stuck, obviously. But, but why is now, it stuck? <laughs> would you be so kind as to go get Nika for me? Yes. Wait, how does that even happen? It, uh, it, it happens. It's fairly normal, really. Doesn't it happen to you from time to time? Mm-hmm. I'll get Nika for you. Brilliant. I'll wait here. <laughs> uh. Funny. Oh, I can't get over it. It's so pretty. Okay, that's the inn. Oh, look. Hey, hey, you have an easel. Are you an artist? Yes, I am. So am I. Do you want to see what I made? Okay. Look. <sighs> wow, you worked really hard on this. Day. But I want to make my next one even better. What should I do? Uh, you'll want to start with a nice canvas. But I don't know how to make a canvas. Let's make it together. All right! You're a nice artist after all. You need to collect boards and fabric. I know where some boards are. Follow me. Okay. Let's do it. Did you see when it ran a reef? I've never seen anything like that. Terrible waste of a good ship. Oh, I can down, sprint. That's nice. <laughs> Boards. Now we just need the fabric. I don't know where to find that. Maybe we should ask someone. Okay. Let's keep going. Oh, okay. Guess I can only talk to people with speech bubbles over their heads. Oh, fabric? So we have everything we need now, right? We can make a canvas from this stuff? I'm just gonna finish raiding this place before I talk to her again. I'm gonna need my own canvases too. Okay. I think that's everything I can. Nope, there. Now that's everything I can grab. Let's talk to this guy. Watch your step there. Lots of moving boxes around here. You looking a little waterlogged. Guessing you just came in off of that ship. 
think you even got some seaweed hanging from your ear. Hmm. Gee, thanks. Yeah, we all have those days, right? I mean, uh, my dad got in a shipwreck once. He wasn't as lucky as you, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, no, he's, he's, he's fine. Just lost his leg is all. Now he gets to order us around even more. <laughs> so, you'll probably be exploring all over, right? Would you do me a huge favor? Sure. My brother loves raspberry-filled pastries. Loves them. He can't get enough, but raspberries don't grow here. So, he puts in an overseas order every two weeks. It's crazy, really. Now, the thing he hates is grape-filled pastries. I, I mean, we all hate them, obviously, but he hates them even more. He'd destroy them all if he could, you know? He once saw an old lady eating some, and he <laughs> grabbed the box and threw it in the ocean. It was the craziest thing. Dang. Okay, so what I did was fill his raspberry pastry bag with, uh, <laughs> grape pastries. Can you oh, imagine gosh. what he's gonna do when he eats one? <laughs> He'll go insane. <laughs> That's, uh, he's quite the prank. He's always suspicious of me doing something like this, though, so it would be perfect if you could play along and <laughs> act like you're a uh, delivery person. So, what do you say? Will you deliver them to him? Hmm. This. I don't want to not do it, so. This is a great plan. Perfect. You gotta play the part, though. Really make them think they're raspberry pastries. <laughs> this will be great. Here, take these. My brother lives over in Nava, so I'll meet you there in a few days, eh? Right? I'll probably be near the bakery. You just come find me, and I'll point my brother out to you. Awesome. Deal. Okay. Ooh, look at that view. <gasps> so pretty. Okay, where's that one lady? She, yeah, she's still following me around. Okay. Okay, how do I do inventory? Tab? This? Okay, that's how I paint. Let's see. Oh, and this is just inventory. Wait. Crafting box. Canvas. Could you paint something? I want to watch a real artist. Okay, now I have to paint something. Okay. Hmm, what should we paint? I have an idea. Look at that view. Mm, okay, wait. Boat. Or that view. Maybe like... Right there. Ew, I don't want that guy in my painting. Move, please. No, am I in the way? Oh, good, I can move. Okay, please walk past me. Thank you. Ah, <gasps> and look! There it is. So pretty. Let's keep going. That painting is amazing! I want to try, can I have a canvas? We found enough stuff, right? Dude, watch out, man. Yes! I'm going to use this for Miss Nika's next painting. She loves art so much. Hey, Miss Nika loves art like us. She always likes my paintings. I bet she'd like yours too. She really likes the eclipse. You should draw her that. The eclipse? Ooh. P is to browse the paintings. Oh yeah, look at that. So pretty. Okay. Well, oh wait, this guy I could talk You've to. Had quite a few shipwrecks here. There's a reef surrounding the bay, and that's what does it. It shouldn't slow down traffic too much, though. I'm just glad you all made it. Uh, Lindo. Lindo is a nice port town, although we don't have much to export anymore, aside from bloom sex. Now, most of our tourism these days are just people passing through on the way in or on the way out of Nava. Fabric. Fabric. We go through loads of it. Oh, <gasps> he just yeah, gave me fabric. These effective for shipping, but will perhaps serve your purposes. Sweet. Thank you. See ya. Oh, I was probably supposed to talk to him for that quest. I gotta take it all. All the fabric. Yeah. Ugh. 
So you've survived too. There's only one of us has been lost at One of us? Oh who was last? Who? Only the most important one of us all, Annabelle. Annabelle, she doesn't sound familiar. Doesn't sound I see. She carries you across the oceans and you don't even learn her name. Annabelle! My ship! My wooden, sea-loving daughter! <sighs> Killed by the damned reefs when we came into this miserable town. I'm very sorry about your ship. Kind of you to say so. Your kindness does nothing to bring sweet Annabelle back to me. What will you do now? I'll be spending the rest of my days mourning Annabelle, sitting here, dreaming of a world where she wasn't destroyed and people actually remember her name. I'm sorry I didn't remember. Off with you. Trade your life for her. <gasps> wow. It's really a terrible place to be stranded. A ship murdering town. Okay. Oh, a ship. Such a good ship she was. I must be going. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Probably for the best. Oh, look at the pretty flowers. <sighs> She's not even using the canvas. Oh, poop. That's the one thing I said he shouldn't do. Try. You're not a bird, Lenny. You need to come down right now. Oh God. You're going to get hurt. Everybody, turn around. What? Why? If you don't all turn right now, I'm gonna jump. Okay, okay. What? Everyone, turn around. Uh oh. I don't know what you're trying to do, but it's time to come down now. I flew! I can't believe it! I flew! Of course oh, that little stinker. I'm just glad you're back down. Don't <laughs> do <that> again, okay? <laughs> oh my gosh! Now that I know I can fly, I won't do it again. Good idea, kid. Oh gosh. Okay, now it's time to check out the inn. Hey. Oh, here's this dude here. I feel so adventurous staying here in Lindo. Where are you traveling from? I live in Nava, but sometimes I just long for the primitive lifestyle Lindo offers. Lindo seems well established to me. How humorous you are. Uh, I like that in a person. Some may find the story of my journey utterly inspiring. Nothing could have prepared me for the muddy paths, the un bearable heat. I even had to eat outside. Oh, <laughs> it was a dreadful experience. So he's never had a picnic? That's sad. All. Sounds like quite the yes, trip. It certainly was impressive on my mm -hmm. part. I so dearly wish my friends could see how adventurous I've become. I do enjoy this exciting new lifestyle I've adopted. A journey to Lindo. Yes, oh. you did. Right. <laughs> I'm sure you memorized. have the saga thoroughly mm -hmm. memorized. Yes, Say, we do. You do some sort of odd things, don't you? Do you think mm -hmm. you could capture my sheer magnificence on canvas? I'm dying to show my friends what a remarkable traveler I've become. Uh-huh, sure. What stunning taste you have. Be sure to capture every bit of my elegance. Great. Have you decided you'd like to paint a okay, bold adventurer? I want to go it's through a the traffic. Romantic destination. I'll be the envy of my friends when I get home. <laughs> oh, it's the most wonderful city. Much better than this place. I can hardly believe I managed to get myself here alive. Mm. Have I'm you sure. decided you'd like to paint a bold adventurer? Oh what yeah. Stunning taste you have. 
Be sure to capture every bit of my elegance. Oh yes, let's let's get his elegance in this picture. Oh, candle. I can take candles for wax, I'm assuming. Oh my god, I got stuck. Ah. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's so pretty, I can't even. All the details. <laughs> Those bottles remind me of Skyrim. Love it. Let's you talk to her. A traveler from the wrecked ship. A cave dweller rescued. Oh, good. Ingolf needs some visitors every now and then. I wish he would spend more time in town, but he'd rather be alone. You live in Lindo? Yes, I run the inn. I always keep a full stock of soup and tea to refresh weary travelers. When I was young, I traveled all over this island. I'd love to adventure again one day. Um... Topic, uh, Lindo? It's a bit more calm than Nava. I think it's quite a nice place to relax. And Nava. I lived there for a few years, working as a baker. I do miss the bustle of the city sometimes. And let's tell oh, you what the guy needs. He does. And what is it this time? <laughs> he has a jug stuck on his head. Again? That's like the eighth time. <laughs> the eighth time. All right then, you better go help. <laughs> okay, let's go help him. And then I'll paint this dude here. Oh, it's so pretty! Alright, while well, she's doing that. Come on, kid. Come here. <laughs> that was a disturbing sound. <laughs> oh, that's really stuck, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty stuck. I think what we need here is some soap. Soap? Would you be a dear and fetch some soap from Amin's house? It's just down the stairs and across the courtyard. Mm-hmm. Yep, I'll go get some soap. From this house here. There's anything we can raid while we're in here. Oh, a kitty! <laughs> Hello there. Can I help you, traveler? Can I borrow some soap? Soap? Well, certainly. May I ask why? It's too weird for words. Uh, hmm. You shouldn't use soap for that. It's not uh. safe. Anyway, I'll ask no more. Here. And no need to return it. What is she? Th is he a friend of yours? Uh, uh We're well, acquainted now. I shouldn't gossip then. Yes. Ah, uh, fine. What's the dirt? He's just such a peculiar man. And you know what? I think Lenny is going to have some real issues when he grows up. Um... He did almost jump off a roof. So you got a point. Why is that? Well, you've seen him. <laughs> he is unhinged. He is a little bit. And not just that. I've been hearing a lot of yelling coming from that house. I think it's quite a broken home. You know, I imagine you'll be traveling all around this island, being a tourist and all. Perhaps when you get to Nova, you should let the sheriff know about Isan. I think it's only right. You know, for Lenny. Why don't you? Well, it's a small town. If word ever got back to Isan that I was the one that reported him, things might be a little awkward. Ah, Being okay. Such a close neighbor and all. You should be the one to report it. <sighs> of course, you're right. 
I suppose if she really it's thinks it's so serious, awkwardness, she it's should go do it. So serious, I'll head over to Narva as soon as I get the chance. Great. Right. Well, here's some soap. Safe travels. I mean, I don't want the guy to get in trouble, but hey, if she really believes it's that serious, then yes, she should be the one to report it. Not a random stranger that doesn't know anything of the situation. You have the soap. Well, let's try this thing then. Mm -hmm. Here, let me have that soap. Give soap. <laughs> Yeah. Well, I guess it was <gasps> well, convenient I can that you dropped in when you did. Thanks for getting Nika. Mm-hmm. How'd you get your head stuck? Well, you are a nosy tourist, aren't you? Beeswax. Uh. Fine. Emine said she heard yelling from your house. Emine? That nosy, stuck-up, goody, two-talon. Uh, if you had to deal with what I have to deal with, she just doesn't like me because I'm not posh like her. This whole town is stuck up. Them and all their judging eyes. You know what? Get out of my house. You're just like everyone else in this town. Coming in here and telling me I'm a bad father? Get out! I didn't say you were a bad father. I know that's what you meant. Just get out. Get out! Maybe you're too unstable to be- No! Fine, you know, I'll respect his wishes and I'll get out after I potentially raid the place for some stuff. Oh. The materials. Okay. See ya, dude. That noise! <laughs> it's the most unsettling caw I've ever heard. Ugh. Okay. So let's paint this dude first thing. I guess I can repaint on this one, but I could just make another canvas. I will need more, anyways. So let's do that. Craft canvas. Hmm, how should we crop it? Gotta get that fire in there. I like that. <sighs> Beauteous. Oh my. That painting! <laughs> it's the most perfect thing I've ever seen! I simply must have it! Of course you must. Whatever. Off your painting. This is wonderful! My friends will be so jealous of me! I think I'll start a collection of paintings just like this. <laughs> He's just gonna get- Can you imagine? An entire <laughs> wall filled with paintings of me. I'm glad you like it. I just can't wait to go home and show everyone this magnificent oh. portrait. The beauty of my features entirely makes up for your lack of proper art training. Wow. Thanks, dude. I appreciate that. Tiny jab. Ah, the traveling artist. Mm -hmm. Goodness, that painting of the eclipse is lovely. Oh, is good me? thing I kept it. Sure, offer I painting. Bet put you up to this. Ah, oh, this is lovely. You're too kind. I'm going to hang this in the room upstairs. <gasps> Ooh, yay, got more money. Let's Certainly. see what stuff she sells. Okay, so she has meadow spice mead or Lindoian brew. Imbued with the quaint, dreamy glimmer of its seaside port town origin. And be sure to keep you're sure to keep you warm on a cold, shady night. This brew is made with honey from the apiaries of East Shade's remote west coast. Okay. Well, let's, let's check upstairs. See if she did hang it up indeed. Is 
Oh, there's a book there. The Architects of Lindo. Lindo's buildings are engineering marvels, as difficult to construct as they are beautiful. The designs of these technical endeavors are the work of one eccentric genius, Azad of Taria. Five years ago, this incredible architect vanished. His whereabouts remain a mystery to this day. Though praised for his accomplishments in engineering and architecture, he is perhaps most widely recognized throughout Eastshade for a rare genetic facial disfigurement. A polarizing celebrity, many praise his genius while others resent his supposedly arrogant disposition. Some even claim that his notoriety is owed entirely to the disfigurement, implying that his credited skills are, in actuality, nothing more than ordinary. However, one only needs look around the town of Lindo to see he has built something wonderful. That's true. This town is really cute. Yeah, I can't go in that room, but can I go in this room? It's locked. So I think I need to wait for nighttime before I can, like, ask about the room. So I guess... Well, let's see. Journal. Yeah, okay. So those are completed ones, and these are current ones. Crank of pastries. Okay, that's that. Mother always wanted me to visit East Shade. Okay. So I have to do four paintings for Mother's Last Wishes. Okay. So maybe I can ask around about that guy, actually. Ask her. You look well. Thank you. Architect that Lindo. Man. He had quite a gruff personality. Not very sociable. But I don't think he meant to offend people. I hope he's very happy. Wherever he is. Okay. Take care now. He probably doesn't know I anything. Just can't wait to go home and show. I've heard of him. A terrible man. Just horrible. <laughs> and not very good looking either. They say he disappeared, and I say good riddance. I figured he wouldn't have anything. Uh, helpful to say. Let's ask her. Nope. How about her? Again for the campus. <gasps> Architect of Linda? Old guy. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that was it? Okay, well. Oh. Thanks for the info. Can't talk to anyone here. Let's see about this dude. Does he know about him? Is it gonna be such a great prank? Uh, don't forget to meet me in Nava. I'm usually near the bakery. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. I can't talk to him about it. I guess that could be our next little thing we do. Gotta find the architect. Annabelle could sail the seas once more. How cruel can this world be? Uh, can't you get another ship? Blasphemy! Have you no sympathy for the brokenhearted? Now leave me be. Oh, okay, I just want to talk to her about this. Why does everyone think I have something to do with his disappearance? I've never seen him. And I certainly haven't taken him as a passenger. Mm -hmm. None of that matters now, though. Oh, my poor ship. Your poor ship. I must I'll be going. Be. Yes. I was there busy working this dock. It's hot. When I was a boy, merchants came to Lindau with strange spices and soft fabrics. They haven't been back in a long time, though. What does Lindo import now? We mainly get shipments of teas, grains and fabrics. And headwear of the latest fashion, of course. Of course. In any case, there's always lots of work to do around here. 
Mm-hmm. Architecture Can you window. Believe he came up with a plan for this city by himself. I'd love to meet him. See ya. Sorry to interrupt your work, my dude. Oh, look at this view. Oh, there's more stuff. Good thing I came down here. Yes. Stuff for more canvases. Haha. -ha. So the first time I played this, I did kind of learn a lesson to only craft canvases when necessary. Because occasionally you do actually need um, the materials for um, other things to craft. Ah! Yeah, he's not gonna help me, is he? Ah, here she is. I saw you talking with the captain. How is she doing? She really loved that ship. I don't think I've heard her talk about much else. Hmm, I wonder if she'll ever recover. How have you been? Uh, let's ask about Architect of Lindo. was all very mysterious. I don't believe anyone's seen him in a long time. Okay. Oh. Oh. Here. Here's this person. Ah, a newcomer. In the future, if you're ever in need of carriage to Nava, I'm your driver. Great. I said in the future. I won't take you right now. Why? You're a newcomer, and you've never been to Nava. Is not so far. And the Volk is lovely. Everyone going to Nava for their first time should approach by foot. I won't be the one to cheat you out of an enriching experience. Okay, that's fair. And if Especially with how gorgeous this game is. You're about, know that you would have to pay it whether you're riding with me or not. If it's your first time crossing. Ah. My ox is strong, no? Look at him. Oh. Cute. Oh man, the sprinting is so fast! Whoa! Ooh, stuff. Roots. Okay. Let's just explore some of these paths then. Oh, more roots. Okay. Oh! Fisherman? Well, Abby, newcomer, are you? Trying to get across the bridge, I guess. I hope you've got the glowstones for it. It's not free, you know. The hmm. rule is you pay once and you can use it as much as you'd like. What do you do here? I may. I'm a fisher. I catch fish, I cook fish, I sell fish. You know. I'm fish, yeah. What yeah. I do here is fish. Sometimes <laughs> I like to visit town, but not very often. What's all that you're carrying? Looks heavy. Are you some kind of painter? Yep. Mm, you know what? Maybe there's a way you can get the ghost stones out of me after all. There's a gazebo in Lindau. Real pretty spot. Maybe you've been there. Anyway, I'd like a painting of that view. I'll paint it for the you. The gazebo is easy to find. It's just behind the inn. And I want the painting from the gazebo, not of the gazebo. It's the view, not the building, if you get my meaning. Mm -hmm. Come fish and fighting today. If you're still willing to play around. Okay. I want to see if he had anything to say about the architect. Okay, let's see. Ah! This is a toll bridge. Of course it is. 60? I don't... Do I have enough? No. Okay, so we'll do that painting for this guy. And... I remember there being a dude up this way. You could get, what, feathers for or something? Oh, it's so pretty. Is 
he like, yeah, I was gonna say, is he like here -ish? Yeah. There's nothing like a good book on a day such as this. Actually, books are the perfect way to spend any day. Do you enjoy reading? I do. I'm glad to hear that. Perhaps I can share my favorite books with you sometime. My favorite books are the ones that inspire me to write myself. How about you? I feel the same way. We creatives, me a writer, you a painter, we've got to stay inspired. Best way I've found is to drink many, many cups of tea. Always gives me a boost. Speaking of writing, if you find any feathers around here, I'd happily buy them. I'm constantly losing my quills. I figure three should do it. Okay. For now, though, I must get back to reading. I think something fabulously dramatic is about to happen. Is there right. something else? Oh, let's ask him about the architect. Ah, that would be Azad. A brilliant, brutally honest, and highly misunderstood man. Undoubtedly too curt for his own good. Perhaps that's why many Lindau folk found it difficult to maintain amicable relations with him. Okay. Is there something else? No. Very well. I'll find you your feathers. Zipline. Oh, I remember that. That'll be fun later. Oh, feather. Okay, so we got what? Two? Oh, and three. Perfect. Let's go return or sell the feathers back to this guy. Ugh, I can't get over how gorgeous this game is. Look. Oh. Just look at that. Beautiful. Where is he? There he is. Aha, my fellow bookworm. Mm -hmm. I have three feathers. Oh, wonderful. Sweet. Hopefully this is enough to last me a while. That's some Thank you stones. very much. Mm -hmm. I do hate scouring the forest floor for these. If you find any more, I'll pay you one glowstone apiece. Is there something else? I don't have any feathers. Okay. I'm only five glowstone away from being able to... Um... Being able to cross the toll bridge. Yeah. Oh, it's so pretty! Okay, actually, let's go collect this stuff over here. While I see it. that. Oh wait, is there like a map? Because that would be nice. I know there will be at some point at least. I just don't know if I have it yet. Okay, interesting. So this is the gazebo he wants me to paint from. And yeah, so it's just this little path up here. Yep, the view is gorgeous from this gazebo, so I don't blame him. Let's see who this is here first. Oh, just some kids? Okay. Oh! Great viewpoint, isn't it? Hi, Nika! Lovely. Look. The eclipse is starting. Oh. Painting? Can I paint it? It looks so cool. Wow. Mm 
Not a bad show, right? No, it was gorgeous. I've missed seeing it from solid ground. <laughs> you couldn't get me out on the oceans for anything. And especially not in a rickety wooden ship. <laughs> if you haven't got lodging for the night, feel free to stay at the inn. I'll leave the upstairs room unlocked for you. Drop in at your leisure. Thank you. <laughs> Don't worry about payment. Shipwreck survivors stay free of charge. Awesome. Thank you. Take care now. Mm -hmm. My garden is filled with all sorts of wriggly critters. Okay. Does she have anything else? No. Okay. I hope he's very Okay, see you later. Oh, such a pretty view. Okay. From here. <gasps> Ooh, should I get mm, the boat? Or that view? I think I already got that view in the one painting, so I'm thinking we go... Hmm, although... Oh wait, he's a fisherman, so maybe we get the more boatish view. Okay, let's do this. And let's do a painting. It's so cool, you can totally like customize it, adjust the cropping of it. There's the easel. Oh, look at that. Oh, so pretty. Okay. So we did that quest. I think the only one over here is the architect guy to find him. We'll finish up with the fisherman and then we'll find the architect and then I think probably leave off this episode at buying the uh, way across the toll bridge. So we're only five glowstone away. I'm sure he'll give us at least five. Well, looky here, you've gone and painted the gazebo view. Are you willing to sell it? Uh, for painting. Oh, how about that? Got myself something fancy. Damn fish on biting today. Mm hmm 25, again, sweet. See you around. Yep. Okay, bye dude. So we can buy that. But I want to explore a little bit more. Let's save. <laughs> I haven't saved in a long time. So, you know, there's that. Actually here. Uh let's see. Options controls. Turn that down a tiny bit. Yeah. Hmm. Graphics quality. Yeah, that's all. Max. It's gorgeous. I'm going to turn the music down even more, though. Because it's really loud. <laughs> okay. Sweet. Apply. Oh. Doesn't say what button the, uh map is. Oh look! There's a little path right here. Let's follow this. Ooh, look how pretty. Ooh! There's a path down this way. A lot of this game is like just really cool like with the exploration and stuff. Oh yeah, old Lindo. Yeah. So this was, oh gosh, I can't remember exactly, but this was where Lindo used to be. And then there was some big ocean storm or something that knocked it out. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Property of Yulia Greywing. It's been raining for several weeks now. Tons of water pouring down in a constant torrent. Our home is filled with buckets to catch spills from the ever-growing leaks. How I long for a moment of clear sky and a break from the incessant drip-dripping as I try to sleep. Disaster has struck. Last night, just after the eclipse, the Red Feathers woke up, woke to a creaking and groaning. They grabbed their children and ran outside moments before the house split from its stilts and crashed into the river below. Madam Baker has ordered an evacuation of all Lindo until they can fortify our homes against this awful wet. Oh, terrible news. And only a day after we evacuated our homes and made camp on high ground, the entirety of our happy village, mainland, in a huge gush, taking our homes down with it. What a horrible thing the weather has cast upon us. Yeah, so it was like a natural disaster sort of a thing. Well, don't mind me taking all your stuff. Thank you. And there's this book here. Nida the Water Fox. Celios laid out his blanket in a patch of sunlight. His water fox, Nida, sniffed about, searching for a nest of eggs to snack on. Stomach growling, he pulled a satchel... Satchet? I think it's satchel. Of frosted biscuits and berry wine from his pack. Nida howled in excitement. She'd found a nest. With a thick crunch, she cracked into the egg, hungrily lapping out the contents before batting the empty shell aside. Celios grimaced as she started on her second egg. As charming as he found water foxes, he couldn't stomach their eating habits. Interesting. Oh, there's another candle there. Double check we aren't missing anything. I think we're good. Let's head down this way. See if there's anything here. Oh. More supplies? Yes, please. Yeah. Oh, man. Again, I just can't get over how pretty this game is. And as a painter myself, I really do just love <laughs> the like whole painting aspect of this game. We're going a little off trail for a second. Because I believe there's some uh, other locations this way maybe? Nope. Okay, can't go that way. But can I go this way? Because it looks spooky and I really want to go there. No. <laughs> I can't. At least not yet. Who knows? But later on in the game, we will get, like, boats and things like that. So... Who knows, we might be able to figure out a way to explore that. The abandoned tower. Okay, now we can ask about the tower. And this is where that guy's cave is that we started at. Sweet. Look at that. Full circle. Stick? Yes, please. Roots? Sure, why not? Oh, I love all the pretty butterflies. Okay, so let's ask her about the abandoned tower. So full of energy. One day he's flapping around like a bird, and the next he's jumping everywhere, claiming to be a frog. Oh gosh. Abandoned tower. Oh yes. 
I saw that from the ship. It looked as if there was a light coming from inside. <gasps> Could it be a, a light, light from inside? Okay. <laughs> and a car to you, Lenny. My father was a fisher of these oceans, so I've been out on the sea plenty of times. I could never be a fisher, though. Why not? Sea monsters. Hmm. I remember playing in there as a kid. The ocean looks beautiful from the top. I wish it wasn't locked up. Hmm. Okay. The salty sea air never gets old. Abandoned tower. Or actually, let's ask about That's old Lindo. used to live. There was just so much rain one year. Luckily, we had the foresight to get out before the mudslide. No one got physically hurt. But the whole town was devastated. Towers like that were used to send fire signals to Nava. But we don't need to do that anymore. It's a bit eerie, but late the other night, I thought I saw lights coming from inside the tower. Hmm. Oh, it's probably just some kids playing a prank. Or Give me some space. Whoa. Pardon me, sir. Okay. Let's check out the room. Yay, more supplies. Gotta love it. Oh, and another book. And look, that's the painting. That's painting I did. Oh look, Shady and Folk Tales, Volume 1. Long ago, the air outside the planet grew terribly cold. Without any fur or feathers for protection, sun began to freeze. She decided to make her flames as big and hot as possible to keep herself warm. Sun worked all day and night to keep her fires burning. Enormous flames reached all the way out to our soil and began to scorch the creatures here. Fires raged, destroying homes and forests, but Sun was too exhausted to notice. Growing worried, the plants and creatures decided to help her. Together they gathered twigs, leaves, fur, and feathers, and wove them all together into a large sheet of fabric. They covered it with clay to protect it from fire and the trees lifted the woven mass into the sky. Take this blanket to rest yourself in warmth, the creatures cried. Sun slipped under the blanket and wrapped herself tightly. The flames cooled and dimmed, leaving the land creatures in darkness. When Sun woke from her nap, her golden light returned to the creatures, who danced and sang, thankful that their gift had worked. And so, that is the story of Sun's Blanket, which she still uses each day. <gasps> oh, sweet! <laughs> I can just wake up at, the, at night time. Yeah, let's do that. <gasps> Yay! Because then we can go see the, um, whatchamacallit, the abandoned tower light. Hopefully. Okay. Ooh, you can tell the lighting's changed. Oh yeah, look at that. We've had quite a few shipwrecks here. Yeah. Is it okay. I work on the docks almost every day. If you ever have any questions ah. about Lindau, come on over and I'll Take do my best now. to help. Okay. Well, here, first, let's look at this. Abandoned Tower. Some Lindau townsfolk spoke of ominous sightings near the abandoned tower at night. 
So... Oh, that's right. <sighs> okay. Oh, wait! She... <gasps> that's right! She well. sells a tea that keeps you warm. Certainly. Yep, here it is. Gotta buy that. Okay, let's drink that. Sweet. Okay, and let's sprint so we can get there fast. I don't know when this will wear off. Oh, never mind, I do. There's a timer in the bottom left corner. I just hope it lasts so I can go investigate. Yeah, look at that. There is a light. What are you doing now? Oh! Jesus. That scared me. Uh... You first. Oh, dear. I must ask that you tell no one about this. The information you have is already too close to uncovering the truth. I'm delivering supplies to someone who is hiding in the old tower. That old tower was once used to communicate urgent messages to Nava using signal fires. Mm -hmm. Some years ago, the need for such a tower faded, and it fell to ruin. That old tower? Someone has taken up residence there. I suppose one could say this person is hiding out. They wish not to be bothered by anyone, and that's something I can relate to. Who is it? This person wishes to remain unknown. And I mean to respect their wishes. I help lock it up, and only I hold the key to enter. I deliver supplies at night. Why are they hiding? I think they feel that the world of people is no place for them. I'm not sure this is the right solution. But the choice is not mine to make. I do hope you decide to keep this a secret. Its mm. exposure means nothing to you and everything to the one who dwells in the tower. <laughs> well... I suppose you've already connected with that. <laughs> There's someone who does it eventually. I figured it the out! The architect of New Linda. The one who designed the beautiful buildings. The one who has been missing for years now. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is for the best. Perhaps it's time someone talked to him. And maybe it's best if it's an outsider. I think, deep down, he doesn't want to be living in that tower. He is rash, and he is proud. Would you talk to him? I'll leave the door unlocked for you. Oh, I thank you. The one who dwells in the tower. Maybe this is... He is rash. And okay. he is proud. Would you talk to him? I'll leave the Sweet. door locked for you. <laughs> Let's wait for him to make his delivery, maybe. Maybe that's what he's getting at. Yeah. The one who dwells in the... Maybe he is rash. Okay. And he is Anyways. Proud. Would you talk to him? I'll leave the door locked for you. Okay. Thanks, my dude. I'll let you... Go back to your cave. Here we go. I'm taking all this stuff. Oh, a feather. Okay, cool. Let's climb the ladder. Just checking around. Okay. Who are you? How did you get in? <laughs> Ingov let me in. I presume the old man told you why I'm here? Why I've chosen to live in this tower of solitude? I think I understand. You understand? Then, you know what it is to be an outsider your entire life? You've experienced what it is to be known for a birth anomaly? You can't possibly understand. Look at my face. It makes you I can't cry. see it. The lighting. Before I can't, man. I, left, I was the subject of chronic nightmares for one child. Her father showed her a new route to school so she could avoid passing me. Estranged from all others in this tower, I am an outsider. But 
Living in the town, I am an outsider all the same. At least here in my tower, I won't fuel the nightmares of children. I dedicated my life to becoming a great architect. For half a century, I labored at this. I built the city they live in. And how do the people of Lindau know me? I am the disfigured architect. The townspeople don't appreciate what I've done. They dwell in the marvel of my life's work. Someone wrote a book about you. Really? What did it say of me? It's about your accomplishments as an architect. Oh. Someone's finally taken notice of my talent? Well, that is interesting. That changes everything. It's about time. This conversation. It was almost enjoyable. Perhaps I'll see you again. But now, I'm afraid it's late. Or early, I should say. I don't believe I invited you into my house. Perhaps it got lost in the subtlety. Oh. <laughs> what I meant was, please leave. Of course, my dude. Yes, I gotta leave. Sorry, I stole some of your stuff, but I'm also not sorry. <laughs> Oh, you know what? There's some more of this stuff to collect. And it's on the way. Might as well. Man, it even looks cool in this, like, off lighting from the, uh, tea. We gotta get to the inn. Otherwise we'll freeze to death. Ah, ah we made it. My garden is filled with that poor I hope he's very towers like that. Oh, it's probably... okay. So nothing new Take yet. Care now. Well, probably because no one knows that I went and talked to him. Okay, let's rest until 8 a.m. That's good. Sweet. Oh, interesting. I didn't even know there was a... You can leave caps lock on to... Continue sprinting. Or click R to auto sprint. That's cool. Azad is back. <gasps> oh no! Have you spoken with him? Only briefly. He was milling about here inspecting every architectural detail. I saw him strolling around town this morning as if he'd never been gone. <laughs> I can't believe it. Where has he been all this time? I heard he was hiding in that abandoned tower. He always was funny, that one. Mm -hmm. He'd been missing so long, I thought the worst. I'm glad he's okay. The salty sea air never gets old. That poor... I hope he's very happy. Oh, okay. So I can't even talk Take to her about it. Now. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we gotta go find him. Which, I do believe, if I remember correctly, he was up in this tower here? Yeah, there he is. This building is truly a marvel. A masterwork of architecture it is. A marvel indeed. The builders wanted to destroy the design, you know. 
They claimed the materials would be too expensive, the details too extravagant. If they'd had their way, we would be standing in a wooden box. By the way, I have some work for a painter like you. Mistake me not, painting is an objectively inferior art form. <laughs> Especially when compared to something as functional as architecture. But in this uh -huh. one instance, I could use your skills. What do you need? I've decided I'm going to move away. It pains me to think that I'll leave behind my creations. But it pains me more to think of more interactions with these wretched townspeople. I'd like a painting of this very city. The composition should include this very town hall, the perched gazebo, and the inn. Mm-hmm. I'll if paint you it. If you hesitate too long, I'll just find someone else. You painters are a glowstone a dozen. Mm-hmm, I'm sure. Well, guess we got a painting to do. And in this gorgeous morning light, too. Yes! Okay, wait, what if I go, like, up here? No, let's go a little more... Night. Eh, there we go. <laughs> Come on! There we go. Okay. Well, what if we... Didn't they say there's like a good view from the old tower? No, that's way too far away. Hmm. Okay, well let's go this way a little bit maybe. Okay, a little more this way. Over here. Oh yeah, here we go. paintings or canvases okay gotta get the pretty flowers in there let's give them a big nice nice big painting Pretty gorgeous. I don't know how they like coded this game to actually work with painting specific objects, but however they did it, kudos to them. <laughs> Let's talk to the him. Painting of my city. Offer painting. It's splendid. Truly. Thank you. And I should also thank you for before. I'm glad you visited me in my town. I'd mm -hmm. like some time to myself. This is indeed a special place. And I'd like to enjoy it as much as possible before I go. Well, wherever you move, I hope you enjoy it. And yeah. Okay, anyways. Time to do the last thing we need to do for this episode. Unlock the toll bridge. Wait, I'm gonna try the auto run. Oh, that's nice. Saves my fingers a little bit. Here we go. Let's pay it. <gasps> Yay! And... Here we are. Across the bridge. Oh, look at that view. Gorgeous. Okay. So, that is all for this time. If you enjoyed this video, please, of course, leave a like. Please comment if you'd, you know, like to see more 
of this game, which I do plan on finishing, but it'll just take a while. This game's like 15 hours of gameplay about. That's how long it took me the first time. Um, so yeah, I'll finish this game and I'll, I'll also sprinkle in some other videos during this game so that it's not just, you know, 15 hours straight of this game. <laughs> You can change it up a little bit. <laughs> but, um, yeah. And then, of course, if you want to see more, subscribe. And don't forget to hit the, you know, notification bell. So you get notified when I do new videos. And also, if you look in the description, remember, there are timestamps. And so you can, you know, use those to skip around. And I also have the link to my Instagram um, on my channel about info and um, in the description of the all the videos so feel free to follow me on Instagram I also post um, actually ahead of time when I'm going to be publishing new videos so yeah that's all from me so see ya <laughs>